Hey guys, how are you doing? Welcome to Techie Simplified English. Now in today's video, I'm going to be talking about Android 12 update for iQOO 7 Legend and how to roll back and what are the bugs, right? So let's first discuss the bugs because that is the reason you would want to roll back. So first and the biggest bug is random reboot. So a lot of users are facing random reboots, which basically means that sometimes while using your phone, your phone randomly is rebooting. And this is not happening once, but a lot for a lot of people, it's happening 10, 15 times. For a lot of people, it's not at all happening, right? So it is kind of a bug that just keeps coming and going. So you must ensure that you know in which category do you stand? Are you facing this constantly? Secondly, please don't install beta softwares on your daily driver phones. Because you're using them daily, installing experimental softwares is not usually advice, right? Another bug is basically slower charging. So here iQOO 7 Legends fast charging has been slowed down in this update. Also the battery drain has been increased. So in this way, if this is a daily driver, you're going to get a lot less from your phone that you were getting earlier. So now we're coming to the uh, downgrade part. Firstly, there are a few things you need to know about downgrading the phone. Your data will be deleted totally. So you need to ensure that you have a data backup. Secondly, this downgrade is hosted on Vivo's website instead of iQOO's website. And no one will be responsible for any damages that you cause to your device while doing so, right? Now, coming to what are the steps you need to do. Firstly, you need to download the file from the link given down in the description. Now, this link also has my social media handle. So if you have any doubts, you can contact me on my Telegram group. The link will be down in all of those links. Or you can directly go to the website that will be linked there for iQOO 7 Legends Android 12 downgrade, right? Once you go there, you download the downgrade file. What you need to do is put that file in your phone's root folder. Basically, I don't want you to root the phone or something like that. What happens is the root folder is basically the first place where you come to when you open your file manager. Once you've done that, what I need you to do is basically back up all your data because it is important. You are going to lose all your data. So make sure that you've backed up your data. Once you've backed up your data, click on the update file. Once you click on the update file from the official file manager, you're going to get a pop-up which says, do you really want to continue with the update? Once you click on that, your update process will start. Basically, your phone will be downgraded to an earlier version of OneTouch OS 11. Once you've done that, make sure that you come to the latest update, but don't update to Android 12. And you're set. Now, if you have any doubts, you can write in the comment or join me on my Telegram group, right? And if you did like the video, make sure that you've subscribed to the channel because the English channel will also be getting videos concurrently nowadays, right? Thanks for watching the video, guys. I'll see you in the next one.